Hi everyone, this screencast is going to show you how to create a shared bookmarks folder in Google Chrome. You might want to do this just to create a folder where you can have uh, links to interesting articles or classroom resources that you want to share with your students so you don't have to send them individual links that they then have to click on and individually bookmark. So to get this started you go to bookmarks in Chrome and open the bookmarks manager. That'll take you to the new uh, Google Chrome bookmarks manager. And in here, you're just going to want to click on New and New Folder. Now, this will take you to a screen where you can name your folder. So I'm just going to call this one Articles for Class. You can put a description if you like. It's not necessary. And then here's the key. You need to click here and set it public. And then Create Folder. And you'll see on the left side here, I've got a folder now called Articles for Class. I can then add bookmarks to this folder and share it with my students. So I'm going to go ahead and add these student notices. Just imagine this might be a, a list of articles uh, about various topics related to your subject area or just important links that they'll need to go to uh, regularly. So I'll add a, one more in here. So I've got my bookmarks in my articles for class folder. It is set to public. And my last step is to click on share this folder. That'll give me a share link that they can then be emailed to students. And the students can click on the link open it and find your list of shared bookmarks. So I'm just going to flip over to my personal account here. I'm going to paste in that link. Now you, your students would probably be clicking on a link from an email, but it's pretty much the same thing. So you can see here now I've got my links and students will be able to access these. They will not be able to delete any of your bookmarks or add their own. This is just for them to access and you are the one controlling the content. So this might be useful just to build up class resources and share them more efficiently. I recommend that your students go ahead and bookmark this page. That way they can easily get back to it. And just so you know that you can actually uh, stop sharing this folder, all you need to do is go back to your bookmarks manager in Chrome. Find your folder. You can click on share this folder and click stop sharing. And that will disable the share link. They won't be able to get into that folder anymore. Uh, so that's how you can deactivate it if you need to. So I hope this helps you more effectively share resources and thanks for watching.